fuse magic here. Oh, I, I created that. I, I still have life cocoon. I definitely, uh, I have nothing for this. So, yeah, big damage here. I do have life cocoon. I'm just going to send it on my warlock. Why not? Yeah, I still have no buttons for this. So, and that's a plus 26 black for cold on tyrannical, baby. That's what I'm talking about. What do we get? 27 fall? A little verse mastery neck. Yo, what is going on, everybody? This is Mystical. Today, I am bringing you a plus 26 Tyrannical Black Rook Hold. We did really, really good. We pugged this key as well. As far as my damage breakdown, Spin King Kick, Rising Sun Kick, Blackout Kick are my top damage. A lot of big pulls, a lot of AoE damage going out. So you get a lot of damage from the cleave from Blackout Kick and Spinning Crane Kick. Weave in your Rising Sun Kicks. Uh, for healing, it is a little weird because of the final boss because you don't cheek a coon for 1.2 million. But most of your healing does come from Ancient Teachings, Shaylin's Gift, and Velvet Mist as well. Uh, as far as my talents go, nothing too crazy. Again, this is the same build I've been using since the start of the uh, season. Really, really liking Expel Harm healing. Expel Harm does so much healing, even though, where is it? I try to, I use it off cooldown. I swear that it's, it's such a good self heal. Um, but yeah, if you have any questions at all, please let me know. I'm more than happy to answer any questions you might have. And that's it for me. Hope everyone's a fantastic first day. Hope you enjoyed the video. I'll see you later. All right. Hello. This is a plus 26. What is this? Black or gold? Mm -hmm. Which is fantastic. I think this is, I think we've done this in 25 on Tyrannical Week. Hopefully we time it on 26. It'd be kind of, kind of nice. I guess we hero this pull, which you want to kick the Soul Blast when you can, of course. Dispel, debuff. I think we just spin the win here. Spin, Blackout Kicks, Rising Sun Kicks, Dispel, nice. Spell here. Do I just revival this? I think. Sacrifice soul. There's not much we can do about that. It's because I'm the staff. Boom. I don't have to spell. Oh, there we go. I did have to spell. Would you look at that? We can always life cocoon as well. I guess the first boss isn't hard enough where you would need lust, but I'm going to wrap this as well. Um, what is it? It's, it's tyrannical and corporal. Spiteful. So it's actually not a bad week to push. So if you're interested in pushing i mean do it and i'm still this is this is one of the dungeons honestly no one roast me please i'm still learning this dungeon okay so yeah, like that so we're st i'm still learning yes i am learning on a plus 26 so um all i know is i need to stay away from these people and the throw glaive uh, can i melt oh no dampen harm here okay yeah we're <laughs> still, definitely still learning this place i don't do it enough i do it like once a week you know i've done this dungeon like three times so uh a lot to learn but i think we're doing pretty good so far um and yeah if you see anything that i can improve upon anything like please let me know um always willing to learn and i am i don't know uh, i have a gr solid group of people that i run with so maybe try and do like a little title push i don't know but i feel pretty good right now um i'd like to get to 3300 um soonish and yeah i can't meld this so it's gonna hurt now i expel harms right when it hit me too expel harm is like the mvp heal by the way i love 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 um expel harm i think it's so good. I hate that it's on the GCD. I wish it was off the GCD, but nice meld on that glyph. Oh, meld that glyph. <laughs> Two melds in a row. Thought it. <laughs> nice, nice. Sometimes it gets stressful. Sometimes you'll hear me go quiet. I'm just trying to focus. But yeah, this is like live commentary. I'm just telling you what's going on. Um, I'll try to explain mechanics as much as I can. Swirling blade, you just want to, or scythe, you just want to um, avoid. Pretty much um soul echoes is on me so i don't know a good strat for this but you basically just want to run these circles i don't know i kind of try to keep them tight in a group i think there's what five or six yeah oh do i still have deep? oh i do i guess it's like six or seven um and then swirling scythe oh no not swirling scythe sorry that's the purple um the reap soul is the frontal that you don't want to get hit by so just don't stand in front of the boss which if you're fist weaving you're probably not going to soul echoes again okay we're just gonna keep spinning 
And that's okay. Because, again, and there isn't much, like, damage for this boss, except for the one, whatchamacallit, the one mechanic where at 50%, I believe he transitions, and that's when, you know, that's where people get one shot. So Reap Souls, don't stand in that that half. I love where this tank is, is tanking this boss, because usually it takes up half the room if you take him to the center. But... He's given us a lot of room to work with, which is fantastic. Uh, Swirling Scythe, just don't watch out for the purple circle. Warlock ha got the other mechanics, so he's running the circles. Reap Soul, we're not standing in front of the boss. Amazing. Um, I don't want to use Life Cocoon here, so I don't think I'm going to. Good. All right. So we're coming about oh 49%. So this is this is the big mechanic. Uh, a bunch of ads are gonna spawn. You need, 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 need to kill these ads. Um there's really nothing else to it. Can I tell this? Rot this? Incap this? Todd? Steph? Nice. Can I sweep? Yes. Okay. Um, I don't think any hit, but I'm still going to diffuse magic here and stand in darkness. Fantastic. Oh, we double dark. I don't mind the double darkness. So that's the thing is like, it's, it's, it's such a like easy mob week. I don't mind the double darkness there. Look at, Oh, I thought that, I thought that was the freaking uh, darkness healing. Yeah. We don't mind that. So we killed all the ads. You can probably live if one ad hits, if you have immunities and if, as a monk, if you have like, if you have like damp and harm diffuse magic, you could probably live too, but obviously it's not ideal. Anyone do the mechanics right, but obviously there's some situations where you can't do that, and that's fine. Um, and we're just gonna do damage here. I don't know right now. I'm holding Chigi, and I don't know specifically why. I guess I don't have to hold Chigi because it takes a while for the after the boss to get to the next mob. So I'm just gonna Chigi here. Is really the one thing I've definitely I am trying to improve upon is my usage of Chi and Life Cocoon and certain mechanic and like certain cooldowns like that um, to make certain pulls easier. That way we don't need to waste like my DPS don't have to waste their cooldowns when I can be using mine. So that's what I've been trying to improve upon, and I think it's been going pretty well. So we don't we don't have Chi for thirty, but doors don't open for thirty. So I guess that works out. So I'm gonna drink super quick here. Oh oh oh, little gate. Okay, okay, save that half a second there. I like that. I like that a lot. For sure. <laughs> yep. This spider spawn. I, I I don't actually can I cocoon you, puppy? In cap, nice. Revival here? Oh my god. Yeah, these spiders hurt. I couldn't heal them though. I, I think that those spiders went straight through my life cocoon too. We, they didn't proc his last, last resort, which is good, but like, holy cow. Not even close to procking? I know. I, like, <laughs> I think he was at like literally half percent. Okay. So, this spider doesn't do much. We could actually probably pull him to the next trash. Yeah, uh, on non four weeks, this this rook spinner is is not nothing crazy. So, this is fine. We're doing mist here. Dispel the debuff when you can. Chigi here, like to throw an invoke mist out. I really don't want him to proc as like last resort because some of this trash coming up is kind of hard to deal with. And I do have PTSD from this dungeon because this is where the Mistweaver Mage Tower is from Legion. Or even now, I think, right? Even the updated version is is here. And so Knife Party, I, I do have PTSD from Knife Party absolutely destroying my my teammates that wouldn't LOS the knife party. <laughs> Probably be so much easier with fist weaving now to do that. Uh this one this this trash is uh, can get a little crazy. You just want to kick the ex oh okay. That was definitely the frontal the ex the explosion. Nice good. GG here. I'm just gonna taunt it. Yeah I, I don't want to deal with it anymore. I don't want my team to stress about it, so we're just going to taunt it. Um, this the archer is going to target people and shoot. He's also going to do a frontal from time to time, so watch out for that. The this guy has a frontal right here, so watch out for that frontal. And then this guy, you want to kick the arcane blast. It is a lot. This trash is an absolute kick that. This trash is an absolute nightmare on four weeks. 
it's doable um but it's a nightmare so learn it again i say this in uh, i mean i've only been doing you know a few of these higher keystones but what i've been doing is on on tyrannical weeks focus on obviously do the boss fights right but also focus on doing the trash right that way when fort week comes around you know what to do because obviously on tyrannical weeks the trash is you know not terrible so it looks like we kind of want to do a bigger pull here seems like the tank is waiting for yeah the scout and the dog i don't think do too much here I'm, i am going to cheat you here don't stand in the front too as well good and we're just going to spam damage here yeah we don't knife party the, oh, oh so the thing about knife party you learn this if you do the mage tower for this you want to wait until the cast goes off before you stun it that's what i learned uh from doing the mage tower because yeah he doesn't actually uh like he'll keep casting it sweep everything here um knife party so you want to wait for him to cast and then interrupt it maybe it's different i don't know maybe it's different from mage tower but i feel like that's kind of uh what i've been doing um, again, Spiteful, a bunch of them spawned. Um, I wish I ran the other direction, but that's okay. Oh, 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 don't die. Stairs are LOS on me. Good. Um, little trick here for this pull. You could use these pillars for LOS. So, you know, all those knife party, the, the frontal from the archer, kick that. Oh, I guess not. Okay, big damage here. Oh, I love this. I love this. Uh, and cap that. Do we Chigi here? Yeah, let's just Chigi. Spin here. So th let's just say this Arcane Barrage was like near me. You could just LOS right here. Uh, we're going to incap this. Oh, okay, quick like that. All right. Set pulse here as well. Good, good. And we're going to... Nice, good kick on that. Oh, I love it. I love it. Again, this is this is another pug that I've, I joined. So... Um, but the tank added me from the last one. So that's kind of nice. You know, I like I like when people add me. Oh, meld this because I'm kind of scared, to be honest. I don't know if I have aggro on something. Sweep everything. Good. Chi burst here. And then see the arcane barrage over there? We're just line siding that. Just look at that. Perfect. I don't know if I'm lagging. No, I'm not lagging. Incap this. We have three incaps, so we have a lot of instant ways to. I'm gonna nice, nice stop. I'm gonna cheat you here too. Arcane barrage. I could rob that as well. I'm trying to position this guy a little bit better, so it's easier for us to LOS it. Good. Nice. Good. Just send the staff here. Why not? Don't stand the frontal. And I've Todd for this archer. Perfect. Nice, good, good. Um, I have no ways to like manipulate the shades. I don't have stun or <laughs> good. Yeah, no, we're doing really good. I think we're doing pretty good on time too. Um, this next boss is the only reason this boss, this place, is like kind of annoying. But outside of that, it's not terrible. Um, normally, I try to face like it's this. This part of the dungeon is really awkward for like. Um, cameras that are super zoomed out so i try to stay like in this hallway so i can actually see what's going on i wish there was a way for blizzard to like make make like smart cameras or something you know like make it make it easier to see what the hell's going on rather than it like i don't know smushing my camera down so you know, i play super zoomed out um, i feel like i've been neglecting shaylin's gift uh this dungeon so far i've just been focusing on damage but yeah, I think I can definitely be Shaylin's gifting more. We're going to make our way over here. I'd like to get a drink. Oh, nice, easy. Of course. Why would I get? Why would I not get targeted by Spiteful so I can get a drink? Yeah, there he is. Look at that guy. Life ruiner right there. Ruining my whole life. You good? Yeah. Quick sip here. This boss has multiple phases. So, the first thing is Brutal Glaive. So, I Chigi it. It's, it's, it does initial damage and puts a bleed. You basically just want to be prepared for the initial damage. The bleed hurts too. And then you also have the Vengeful... What was that? 
I, don't, I forget what that mechanic's called. But he targets three people, and you want to just go to the side. Brutal Glaive again on my mage. You you just want to save up if you're fist weaving. Um, you just want to build up your damage for the initial damage of that of that uh, mechanic, and then just crank. Um, so here's this like phase two, if you want to call it. He he spawns two adds. You just want to kick one of them. The the arcane blast, arcane blitz. Um, it's actually really it's decently easy to heal through this because you can cleave heal off of both of them. So it's kind of nice. So watch the frontal from the from the guard, and then kick the arcane blitz of the arcanist. And he'll also target somebody. I'm just gonna cocoon that guy because I see that we walled, and so I'm kind of I don't know. I'm kind of scared for my warlock a little bit. Um, we're gonna manatee here as well. And yeah, we're doing a pretty good job. Sixty-four percent is pretty good. Um, it's gonna send an essence spawn here. If I see a brutal glaive coming out, what I'm, I'm gonna chiji here. Brutal glaive chiji here to help soak the damage. Nice alter time for my mage. Um, that's obviously if we were in voice, that'd be something like I'd be say you're fine here. So nice packed from the warlock. I don't have. This is gonna hurt. Oh no, no, he still has packed. Oh, that's so good. That's really good for us. The warlock still had packed up, I believe. So it, it kind of soaks some of that damage from the uh, Brutal Glaive. Nice, good. All right, we're at 50% now. Uh, we're doing pretty good. I just need my... Okay, good. This is fine. Be healing. He kept this guy back here. I feel like it's easier for me to get to that one. Shadeloon's Gift here. Oh, that sucks. Oh, so he soul on himself. Oh, I have Cocoon in two seconds. Nice, 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 nice. Manatee here. All right, good. Because I need a freaking break, man. Holy cow. Oh, no. All right, we're going to put some hots out. Good. Manatee here. Okay. Chigi here. Cocoon you. Cocoon you. You're good. You're good. Don't freak out. You're good. For some reason, I thought he was phasing again. But maybe he doesn't. I, th I could have sworn he phases again. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Oh, no. I'm just lost, man. I'm so lost. <laughs> nice. Good alter time for the mage. Thank you. I love you. Good. He alters at 100%. Nice. There it is. He alters at 100%. So then after he gets the initial damage, he uh, he's fine. Good. But they're still cranking. They're still getting cranked with damage. Felt missed here. Oh, yeah. Because they get the eye beam right, and it follows them. Nice. Good kick on that. I don't have cooldowns for him. We're doing mist here. Okay, maybe that's hopefully enough. Kick that. I'm hoping it's enough. Nice. Oh, we got hit by the frontal. Um, I do have Chigi back, though. Oh, shoot, and a corporal went off in the back. That's not good. Okay, it's it's okay. It's okay. We should be okay. 8%, nothing crazy. All right, we got the Dark Rush. We're going to dampen harm here. Bring this to the side. Manatee here while we're waiting. I cocoon you. I cocoon you. All right. Okay, a lot of damage here. All right. Damage you. We did have an corporal grow off, which is a little unfortunate, but I think you know that's not terrible. I think you can release, and we should be okay. All right, we're about halfway done with the dungeon too. Oh. Want to dodge the rocks here? Otherwise, you die. Okay, nice, nice, good, good. Man is fine. The man is completely fine. I, I'm for for here because I swear I've uh, kicked that. I thought I had aggro on something. Nice big pull here. Love this pull. I'm just gonna target this guy. Sweep everything. She, she pulls here. Dispel that. 
Feyland Stomp. Just spin the win here. Oh my god, we're doing 115k DBS. Are right, we gonna rob these guys, by the way, away from my team? Oh, we kind of pulled them in there. That's fine. That's fine. Yeah, we're good. Fantastic, fantastic. Good, good. And yeah, we just kind of kite these guys now. I got two of them kind of running at me. That's okay. Good. All right, let's keep, let's march on. Good. Okay, big damage. Uh, Phalanx Stomp here, Manatee. Um, I guess we just Chigi here, because again, there really isn't much going on. Um, we're probably going to sweep... Oh, okay, that's, I need to get a DR tracker so I can track DRs in PvE. Because um, I don't want to... I hate DRing things. It might just be a PvP like mindset, in my opinion, but I'm going to route these guys. Um, but I hate DRing anything. I'm just going to cocoon you as well. And we're going to spin Chi Burst here. Really hoping I could just leg sweep the Spitefuls there and just kind of focus on keep my team alive, but that kind of that's gonna hurt. Okay, Manatee here, good, nice. Oh my god, this trash is so much easier. It's not on Fort. Like there really isn't even much to do. Just make sure you interrupt the potions and you're good. I'm gonna start dealing with these boulders, similar to the other part. Just dodge. Keep dodging. Dodge more. <laughs> A lot of rocks. Oh, that's okay. I can res them. I can res them. You're good. All right, we res. Which is fine. I tripped. <laughs> Just demon hunter things. That's fine. I'll drink super quick here. Nice. And then, okay, we're just in it. I love it. I love it. I'm just going to cheat you here. Thunder focusing enveloping mist. Get some hots out. Extend those hots with my rising sun kick. And I'm going to phalanx stop and spin. So for this trash, only one goal is to kick the fell frenzy. That's it. So I'm going to just target one. I'm going to kick as fast as possible so I don't overlap kicks with anybody. And I'm just spinning to win. That's literally it. One thing you can do is you could put one of them on focus. That way you don't kind of lose track of them with all the bats. Um, but don't be intimidated by all the ads. I don't have a kick for that. He does get it off. So that is a bit unfortunate. I don't know if that's going to kill us. I don't think it does. But I probably don't want it to happen again. I'm going to send a staff here. Incap this. Nice incap from Demon Hunter. Yeah, that's uh, okay. Well, the one goal that we had kind of didn't, you know, a little unfortunate. Dampen harm here. I'm going to sweep this because I'm going to kick that because I see a spiteful kind of targeting me. So I don't want to. I don't want to deal with that. Big damage here. Good. Manatee, fantastic. Oh, hello. Uh, you want to keep running with this trash? Though. I'm sure the tank knows that. But if you run through to the end, it doesn't summon any bats. So hopefully, maybe maybe this is a different strat. I don't know. Who knows? Maybe this is maybe this is different. Maybe we learned something new today. Hopefully. Don't have kick for that. I can Todd, though. Spamming Todd. Yep. Good. I think, did this guy get Fell Frenzy off? Yeah, he did. That's okay. Oh. Okay, maybe there's no bats now. Look at that. Spite for me. Get away. Okay. Good. Good, 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 good. Really well done. Hopefully this next Spiteful doesn't summon. I mean, it doesn't, doesn't target me so I can get a drink. Right now, my tar my party is trying to decide if we want to lust now or later. Um, yeah, we definitely want to save lust for the final boss. I'm gonna try to drink here. I swear, if it targets me, I'm gonna be so sad. Of Why wouldn't it target me? You know. Boom. Drink. All right. Um. This one, this this fight has definitely some healing you need to be careful of, but it's more of like a mechanic thing. Um, the main thing is you want to soak whoever gets targeted. So it's unstoned. I'm going to try to target. It looks like my demon hunter is going to soak at it. A demon hunter. Okay. You can't, if when you have this debuff, you can't soak that again. And then what I do is I save Shaden's gift for this. 
Um, the one thing that sucks about it, I wish I wish you could use cast chain once it gets while moving. Fell vomit, you want to bring that to the outside because it makes a straight line straight through the platform. It's like a soft uh, and rage where like you can run out of platform if you don't do a good job. Um, dang it. So I'm going to soak this one. I'm going to dampen harm here. Stand between the boss. Oh. I mean, okay. I mean. All right. Revival here. Fell vomit on me. I'm going to bring this all the way to the outside of the platform. Once the line's gone, you can go. Next one's on y'all. I mean, I had it. You know what I mean? All right. I'll wall this one. No one soak it. All right. Let me let me do something, okay? You want to heal yourself up, though, because you are going to get hit with... Yeah. I'm going to cocoon you and then just send the Shaylin's Gift. I wasn't sure if my... Fell vomit on me. I'm going to bring this outside of the platform. Once the line's gone, you can leave. Okay, good. I cannot soak this. Oh, it's on the mage. All right, the mage should be okay. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to send the Chiji here before this big AoE damage. Nice in cap there. So now everyone should have a little bit of a little cocoon. Yeah, someone sent the line straight through. That's okay. That's okay. Next to me. Oh, sheesh. That's that's a confident tank right there. I don't mind that. Um, fell vomit on me. Where's the line? I don't see. Oh, is that? I, I couldn't see the line. That's actually 100% my fault. Diffuse magic here. Shaylin's gift. Nice. I'm glad he got in range for that. Manatee here. Oh my god. Tell me I'm getting it again. Okay. Can I just... I just want to hit... The, let me just whack you, please. Okay. I need... Okay. Okay, did not proc is caught. Okay, that proc is caught. <laughs> I was going to say, god damn, fail vomit on me. Chiji here. Alright, we're starting to freak out a little bit here, I'm not going to lie. Dampen harm here. Nice. Health zone? Shaylin's Gift? Oh, yes. Definitely underutilized spell is uh, Health Zone. I mean, from, oh. Watch the Fell Vomit. I'll try to bring this out for us, puppy. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Melt? Oh, thank you. My heroes. Oh, my God. This guy's got two of them. This guy's got two of them. Oh, my God. How are we alive right now? I was going to say. Like, how the hell are we alive? Oh my god. It's because we weren't. Nah, we were alive. I tried so hard in that. <laughs> By hunting me in court. Oh my god. You do love to see that. You do love to see that. Um, this trash isn't too bad on non four weeks. I'm actually just probably just going to sweep everything. Yeah. Damage here. Dodge. Ba basically, just dodge the brown swirl. That's that's what you want to do. Boom. Just dodge it. You could stun it. You could rop it. The cast. You could do anything. It's. I think it's called Raven's Dive. Just want to not. Just don't want to not get hit by it. Good. Good. Dodge. You get stuck. Okay. You know, re they got to update that model, I swear. You know, I feel like I was definitely not in it. You know what I mean? Spitefuls. We're going to rop all these guys to the side here, and hopefully it'll allow us to keep running forward. That's the hope, at least. Yeah. Just keep running. Yep. Run forward. And we should be okay. I do have Chiji for this next pull. And then we should be pretty good on trash as well. Yeah, we're going to Chiji here. We're just going to Chiji and spin, to be honest. We do have sweep as well. That's a stun for my demon hunter. No spitefuls as well. It's going to sweep everything. And yeah, love that pull. Love it on those casts. You could just pull the cast. It's really nice. All 
All right, be healing here. Get some manatee, feline stomp. Don't stand in that. Fantastic. We're doing a great job here. Just honestly, just spinning to win right now. Nope, nope, nope. <sighs> Good. And I'm saving my Rob for. Nope, nope, nope. I mean, oh my god. All right, here we go. Our goal for this boss is to get through the first phase. That's what we want to do. This boss has two phases. Nice. That's why we lost. That's why we saved Lust. Felt missed here. Good damage here. I'm going to cheat you here too. Dodge this. Whirling Blade as well. Don't want to get hit by it. Whirling Blade is that right there. It's like, a, you know, the little war really flicker thing. Okay. This is fine. Good dark. Don't mind it. Dodge this. Manatee here. All right. Just need to get this guy down to... I'm setting, I'm setting the staff. Oh, okay. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. b resin. Yep. Yep. F fantastic. You know what? Sacrifices need to be made. You know what I mean? All right. This guy, yeah, a few, a few more mechanics that aren't as fun. Uh, you just want to get through this first shadow bolt volley, like. So what I'm gonna try to do is I'm gonna I'm gonna try to I'm gonna probably gonna defuse it. I'm probably gonna defuse it. Actually, I'm gonna four brew it. Nice darkness as well. I'm gonna shadow's gift as well. Fantastic darkness. So now we should get a buff here, and I feel like the rest of the dungeon or rest of the boss is pretty easy. We got a huge Shaylin's Gift here. Not Shaylin's Gift. Um, I'm just going to Cocoon because I don't know what's going on with my mage. Um, Chi Cocoons. Incap this. Oh, we just triple incap that. Dodge this. Oh, my God. It looks like it was going the other way. <laughs> Manatee here since I got some room. And I do have Revival, so... Hi, Shaylin's Gift here. Yeah, I was going to send a little Shaylin's Gift here. Uh, don't stand in the clouds. Obviously, they put you to sleep. Um, Swarm, you want to just kill this. It's kind of similar. And then we're going to defuse magic this Shadow Bolt Volley. Manatee here. And that's that's essentially a fight. I mean, there's I have no cooldowns. I can health on this. And I could Shaylin's Gift here. Boom. Perfect. Cloud, don't stand in it, of course. Big damage here. Oh, I have Chi-Gi? Good, 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 good. Okay, good. Everyone has the Shikaku now. It gets buffed by the the buff from the, the boss, so. D diffuse Magic here. Manatee here. Or, sorry, Dampen Arm. Shaylin's Gift here. Revival here. Before it goes off, so I didn't, I didn't want my mage to die there. So, that's kind of important. Spell Harm here. Cloud, Dispel you. Manatee here. Diffuse magic. Be healing. All right. Where's this guy? Where's this thing going? All right, it's coming towards us. Tiger's lost here. Okay. There's also AOE damage going on throughout right now. So we have two minutes. So I think we are looking pretty solid. Um. Yeah. Manatee here. Yeah. I don't think I'll have Chi. Oh wait, I should. Building up damage here. Chigi here. Oh my god. Look at how... No one's even going to take damage right now. I love it. I think my mage used like Blazing Barrier there. I still have it. Oh my god. We have so many shields for this. Holy cow. I love it. Send the staff. Chi Burst here. Nice. Uh, oh. Diffuse Magic here. Oh, I, I agree to that. I, I still have life cocoon. I definitely, uh, I have nothing for this, so. Yeah, big damage here. I do have life cocoon. I'm just going to send out my warlock. Why not? Yeah, I still have no buttons for this, so. And that's a plus 26 black for cold on Tyrannical, baby. That's what I'm talking about. What do we get? 27 fall? Reverse mastery neck. <laughs> 